so here I am, and we've been in conversation about life. And so why did you come in, and what have you gotten out of our sessions together? I was desperate. Uh-huh. Desperate and hungry to change. Around what? Relationships? Like a relationship, uh, grieving over my mom. Um, like trying to get out of this, um, this web. Mm. You know, this web, like, you know, um, and, and, and my past would not let, let go of that. Uh-huh. You know, so came here to kind of that and to grow up. Wow. Well, I think you've done such an amazing job in like three sessions and the courage that you've shown mm -hmm. has really shown through for who you truly are. Mm -hmm. What was the biggest uh, change that you saw? The biggest change I saw is I am stepping into my womanhood from, yes, I grew up uh, in age, but mentally and emotionally, I was a, I was a child. Mm-hmm. 12 years old, I'm not quite sure why I used 12, but 12 years old. Um, and growing up to be and stepping into what, what I'm supposed to be. A healthy, wealthy, gorgeous woman. Beautiful woman. Beautiful woman. Yes. And after this session, I realized that I need to do this to honor my parents. Mm. Because I think I was, you know, I think they need to know that they gave birth to a warrior, a fighter, just Beautiful. like they were. So, yeah, to honor them, too. That's awesome. And um, what's next for you? Um, I you know, even talking right now, I, I don't know, but I feel in my heart and, and, and the universe, and the, it's going to be a, a breakthrough of, of what God, my God, and what he has stored for me. So it's exciting. It's, awesome. it's exciting to think that, you know, that I was uh, I was in a cave, you know, in dark, you know, with prayer and with, with your help. Um, I'm coming out. And again, going back to my parents, I'm, 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 they're looking at me right now and they must be so proud of me. Mm -hmm. So they're no yeah. longer here on earth, no. but they're with you. They're with in me. spirit yes. all the time, all the time, blessing you and guiding you. Yes, yeah, yes. yeah. I think you're such an amazing woman, and the I just can't wait to see what what unfolds for you in your world. Only in like three or four weeks, you've been able to transition yourself from completely being stuck in your day job and uh, so upset that you couldn't function to this woman who's sitting here as this courageous warrior. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Because um, when you hit the when you hit that um, the line of desperation and you're suffocating, you will become a warrior, and it's in my DNA because of my again my parents. They gave me birth. That's who they were. That's so awesome. I'm stepping up to what who gave who they gave birth to. So how did these sessions help you? They make you, uh, well, it helped me by um, talking it out, realization of what I've been hiding. I mean, obviously with you, you can't hide. <laughs> you know, you, you must, as much as you try, you're like, ah, oh, no, you're, you're lying. Um, <laughs> I just extract it. Exactly. So um, through extractions, through truthfulness, through mm -hmm. not being judged, mm -hmm. um, has helped me so rapidly to reach this point and again I was I was very desperate right I mean I was I was very desperate I don't like I don't like seeking help or even talking to my people close to me because I always think they don't understand what I'm talking about mm -hmm. because and they wouldn't know because my problem is so, so much deeper and so much deeper rooted in that it needed a professional to but in doing this work you can see how insignificant yes. the, the problems were oh yes it was a um, small dust on the big table as yes <laughs> illustrated today um, I was magnifying things that they were so minute yeah and in our mind we hold things that are that maybe it took place one moment in time and we magnify it so much that we allow that little girl in us 
to run our whole lives as an adult. And that's scary. That's scary and that's dangerous because then that little girl will get married and that little girl would seek help from a man who's probably struggling himself, you know? And when I die, I don't know if this came to me, when I die, I do want to be a happy, fulfilled woman. Of course. You want to fulfill your legacy. Yes. And that can only be done if you look at yourself in the mirror and face it. And I have... I'm facing it. Yeah, and I think one of the key areas also that that I was I'm so proud of you for is that um, just really being able to genuinely see that the man who steps into your life, who you want to attract into your mm-hmm. life, now that you've removed that illusion of that little girl running everything mm-hmm. and having to be in power, yeah. that you can actually love, allow someone to love you. And to step into your world and not have to show up as this masculine little girl protecting herself. But you can allow those guards to go down and allow that man to come into your life and be your your soulmate. Who, yes. who will be your soulmate. Yes. Who is your soulmate. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh my gosh. Yeah. And it's very tiring, to be honest with you, to, to show up in the world the person that you're not. Oh yeah, and, and 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 to show your stronger side of you, um, it's very tiring. Because when it, when I would go home, I would be so tired. Constantly, I'd be tired. Actually, matter of fact, like um, because I was showing up in the world with the person that I'm not. Yeah, it takes more energy to to try to pretend and be someone you're not than really authentically be yourself. So yeah. when you show up as yourself, you know. You don't. You only need to put energy into um, pro- uh, moving yourself forward, mm-hmm. and that's fun. Yes, because you're in the flow, and yes. the energy is just moving you. It's like the the ball rolling from the top of the mountain. Yes, you the know, momentum. it just it's the momentum. It catches on. It'll just take you, as opposed to you trying hard to make something happen. Yeah. So with that, yes, that's true. Um, it's hard, but. If I feel that it's hard, but if you want to live, well, it's only hard in your mind. Well, it's right? hard in your mind. That is true. But like, it's hard in your mind. But you know, you, uh, we've been programmed for. I mean, I've been programmed for so long that it has become reality. Mm-hmm. And to get out of that is is it's it's you know you have to be conscious of how I'm thinking, what I'm saying, what I'm doing. Because it's easy to go go back. But again, with the you know with the tools that you provide and through prayers and you know the loved ones around me I I don't I don't I mean I don't see myself failing I don't I mean I, I have all, not that bold I mean I'm being bold but it's true but that's who you are yeah you're stepping into your power <sighs> you're stepping into your calling yes and that's who you are yes you are nothing less than that you are perfect whole and complete oh I like that <laughs> you are and what's the affirmation that you've put together for yourself that you've written down on the back of your door. Oh, that I am a wealthy, healthy, generous, beautiful um, woman. That it's my divine calling, and this is my purpose. Awesome. This is my purpose, and awesome. I also have to like honestly thank God that He connected me to the right people through my sister, and it, it connected me to the right people because if you don't have the right tools and the right people a man can get kind of murky well I I, uh, completely am grateful that you have trusted the space yeah because I was not trust I don't trust people I know (laughs) (laughs) we've talked about that I don't trust people and know the process but for me to even be doing this it should show you that how how well because you saw results well that's true I saw results and Mm -hmm. I saw the result, and it's allowing me to grow up and to kind of expand my boundaries. Awesome. This is expanding my boundaries. Yes. Because I would not let anybody, obviously, you know, ask me questions. Record me. (laughs) Well, I thank you. I thank you for trusting the space. I thank you for being so generous and so kind. Thank you. Because I know that by other women who are also sometimes trapped in the same space, who don't trust, who don't know how to free themselves, it's good to hear other people 
And just by sometimes listening to other people, talking about it frees you up. So that's mm-hmm. being in service. Oh, yes. I didn't think of that. Absolutely. So you're I'm always being in service. You're a very generous woman. And, Thank you. And I think uh, you're going to do... I can't wait to see what you're doing in the world. Uh, me neither. <laughs> me neither. Because you're um, pretty amazing. Thank you. Thank you're you. a rock. Thank you. I, I Again, like I said, it's... You, what you see, what you see here. I mean, I know this session has been about, about my parents, so you know I do have to say what you see in front of you is what they wished, hoped, and prayed for me to be in this in this stage yeah. to call myself a warrior, not as like a masculine warrior, but a warrior of that does not get defeated. You know, does a good warrior, a leader, always will know when to stop and look at themselves in the mirror and say what I need to adjust in me to be a leader so that's what I'm doing and that's what my parents have um, I, I know for sure wanted me to do so this session was all about connecting you to your source yes where you came from yes and how you can better yourself now because they gave you the tools to get to some place and, mm-hmm. and they gave you the gift of life yes they did and you get to now go and create it in the world and they gave you so much love too oh. abundantly beyond beyond yes I'm very blessed and very lucky to have the parents that I have that yes. I had still have spiritually of course they're always very yours lucky. yes they're always yours thank you so much for sharing yourself <laughs> you are very welcome <laughs> Do you think things came out? I don't. I never. I mean, with this, well, all the sessions since it's been going on since six. I didn't. I didn't call myself a warrior. I didn't call myself anything. Courageous. What? Well, whatever. I mean, you know, warrior. That's what's the. the you know. So I think this. Um, this has helped me, to be more appreciative of my parents. This I mean this whole session obviously since six but I feel like the conclusion of ending this session is they're the best parents that any girl can ask for. Absolutely. And you the most f- beautiful, the most humble humbling parents ever. And my brother is in the military, my sister's a nurse. I mean I am doing the the job that I'm doing. You, 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 that should just tell you how great my parents were. Of course. And you acknowledging them and, and really acknowledging them today is freeing you. It's all about freeing you. Yes. Yeah. So we've been in a conversation together and um, having a time talking about life. So how is it that um, that you came in and you wanted to you wanted to see me? Well, um, life became a bit overwhelming. Um, needed direction, confused, to be unconfused, to um, figure out what I need to be doing. Yeah. So how did you? Uh, we've met like three or four times already. What did you get out of it? What did you feel like, you know, that was really um, a, a significant breakthrough for you? Wow, well, yeah. Um, I feel that today I'm sitting here with a clear mind and with a clear heart is because of the times we met. Um, and what was it that, that um, allowed you to, what, what did you learn that helped you to get from where you were to now? Well, I learned that there was a lot of things hidden inside of me that um, I was covering it with other things, things of the world, worrying of worrying or uh, just things, loud noises, um, covering it with that. And this, the sessions that I've been coming to has made, made me realize that, that there's a lot of things deep inside of me that had to come out. In, in order for me to uh, flourish and to actually be a human being again. Mm-hmm. And how do you feel now? I do feel um, at this moment um, light, <laughs> clear, 
um, like confident maybe? confident I do feel confident um, testing my vulnerability right now <laughs> um, but I feel good I do I do feel good I feel like I have a lot of homework to do mm-hmm. well you've come a long ways oh. and I think you're so courageous well thank you <laughs> awesome <laughs>